Hey everybody, Josh coming to you live once again with Barefoot Shoe Reviews. Today, I've got the Groundies Havana model. And I've got my yellow shirt on in honor of these yellow beauties. And if you've watched very many of my videos, you guys know I'm not afraid of color. And these are no exception. I mean, but look at the style, dude. Just sitting there. They're not even on my feet. Look at them. They are just gorgeous, man. I love these things. And um, they don't, I don't think they make them anymore, uh, at least not this color, but I just looked online. They're still there. You can still find them if you know how to look, if you know how to search and, and find stuff. Uh, they're there and they're actually pretty reasonably priced right now too, about half, half of what they cost once upon a time. And uh, so I've had these things, I don't know, I, I think I got them early this year, 2021. And, uh, you know, yellow shoes is not something you're going to wear every single day. And they have lots of other colors. So if you don't like yellow, don't worry about that, dude. Havana, these are a light, comfy, casual shoe that is just, uh, these are smooth daddy shoes, man. If you know what I mean by that, <laughs> these things, dude, um, five out of five stars uh, on these groundies. And I, I have done some other videos on other models of groundy shoes. I've loved every single pair of my groundies. Do props for groundies. They, they've been around a couple of years now. Uh, not as long as maybe some of the other shoes, uh, the Barefoot Shoe Companies. But, dude, they've got lots of selection for as long as they've been around. I don't know if it's five years or what. I don't know how long they've been around. But uh, they've got a lot of selections. So far, so good. Every single pair I have, I love. They, they're top shelf. Um, the craftsmanship. Uh, none of none of my groundies are falling apart, coming unglued, coming unsewn, any of those sorts of wear problems. They all have pure barefoot um, values in the sense of these following key things. Zero drop from heel to toe. No slants, no heels, none of that nonsense. You're not walking around on an angle, okay? You're walking around on a flat surface the way your feet are designed to function. <laughs> and check it out on the inside zero arch support. Now, uh, you know, if you've got to make that transition to barefoot with zero arch support, that's because your feet are designed to not have arch support in your shoes. <laughs> of course, you weren't born with shoes anyways, right? Your feet are designed with an arch, the strongest structure known to man practically, right? But if you go your whole life jamming stuff up under there to support it unnecessarily, those muscles, those ligaments, atrophy, they wear out, they get weak. And then you need arch support at that point as you get old. Uh, like me, I'm almost 50. Um, I've been wearing barefoot shoes for about 10, 11 years at this point, since around 2010, 2011. Uh, almost exclusively, I have one or two pairs that aren't barefoot shoes. Um, but uh, your feet will gradually strengthen and get back into the shape they were designed to function uh, in terms of the arches. Also, key to barefoot shoes, besides the zero drop, besides the no arch support, is wide toe box. Why? Because that is the shape of the human foot. Now imagine that. If you're going to put a human foot in there, you should probably make the shoe roughly the same shape as the foot that's going to go in it, right? Not put it in some pointy little V, uh, sh tightly pointed shape thing that's not wide, not the shape of a foot. You want something that's the shape of a foot anatomically like these groundies Havanas. So, um, and then the flexibility stuff, right? Ground feel. So you maintain contact with your environment and uh, know what's going on, know what's up, and your feet can move naturally. Here's the taco test, like the side-to-side -side roll of the, of the sole. No problem there. Uh, twisty test. Booyah. Look at that. Dude, these, uh, and I love the color personally. I mean, dude, these are sick. I, I, I rock this with this shirt, some jeans, done. Go to the store. They're eye-catching. Uh, you know, I'm kind of an introvert, but I... I like having people go, oh, those shoes are sick. Where'd you get those, you know? Um, but anyway, uh, so five out of five stars. What do you want to know? Ask your questions down below. Uh, give me your comments. Shoot me your thoughts, whatever. Uh, tell me, dude, you, you wear lots of colors. I hate, but, you know, whatever. <laughs> I don't care. Say, say whatever you want to say. Hit like, hit subscribe. Check out my other videos. I got lots of stuff. If you don't like yellow shoes, you don't like groundies, uh, you know, I don't know what, what you would like or not like, but I have a lot of different styles, dress shoes, casual shoes, sandals, all barefoot value shoes um, from my collection. Check out the reviews and we'll see you next time. Be good in the meantime. See ya.